Welcome to Scripture's History. Have you ever considered the profound history embedded within the DNA of Middle Eastern populations? While much is discussed about ancient biblical tribes, how well do we understand their true genetic identities? In this video, we'll delve into the captivating genetic heritage of modern Jewish communities, focusing on Ashkenazi, Sephardic, and Mizrahi Jews, and explore their connections to ancient Israelites. Additionally, we'll examine the genetic lineages of ancestral Arab tribes, including the Ishmaelites, Midianites, Ammonites, Moabites, and descendants of Joktan. A pressing question arises which contemporary Jewish communities are genetically closest to the ancient Israelites and how has intermixing influenced both Jews and Arabs over the centuries? The answers lie within genetic markers that have traversed millennia, either preserving ancestral traits or blending with other populations. Does science affirm historical and biblical narratives or will it unveil unexpected revelations? Prepare for an enlightening journey into the secrets of Jewish and Arab DNA. Unearthing genetic links through archaeology. Archaeological sites such as Tel Beth Sheen and Tel Megiddo, both mentioned in biblical texts, are invaluable for archaeogenetic studies. Samples obtained from these locations enhance our understanding of the genetic ancestry of ancient Israelites. These findings reveal that ancient Israelites descended from at least three major genetic groups, the Natufians, Neolithic Anatolians, and Neolithic Iranians. These genetic contributions shaped the Semitic DNA characteristic of various ancient Semitic communities, including Jews, Arabs, Syrians, Palestinians, and others in the region. Studying these genetic fractions allows us to identify migration patterns, cultural interactions, and environmental adaptations that significantly influence the history of local populations. Thus, sites like Tel Beth Sheen and Tel Megiddo play a pivotal role in bridging the past and present of Jewish communities and neighboring populations. Ashkenazi Jews Tracing European and Semitic Roots Ashkenazi Jews, often associated with Central and Eastern Europe, have been subjects of extensive genetic research, contrary to the debunked theory that they descend from Turkic Khazar converts. Robust genetic studies confirm that Ashkenazi Jews have a direct lineage tied to ancient Israelites. Over centuries, intermixing with European populations occurred, evident in certain genetic markers. Despite these influences, Ashkenazi Jews retain a genetic identity clearly connected to their Jewish origins. The term Ashkenazi derives from Ashkenaz, historically linked to regions in Europe particularly Germany. Today, Ashkenazi Jews constitute a significant portion of the global Jewish population and represent one of the main groups among Jews living in Israel. Genetic studies indicate that Ashkenazi Jews possess a blend of ancestries, a substantial European component and a notable Middle Eastern component, reflecting their historical migrations and intermarriages. Despite the significant European contribution, Ashkenazi Jews maintain a remarkable genetic connection to ancient Israelites. This intermarriage over time reflects the complex history of this group, which adapted and survived in different cultural and geographical contexts without losing its Jewish identity. Thus, while genetic composition varies, Ashkenazi Jews remain an integral part of the historical and cultural continuity of the Jewish people Sephardic Jews Preserving Ancient Lineages Sephardic Jews trace their origins to the Iberian Peninsula, encompassing Spain and Portugal, with communities also established in parts of North Africa, such as Morocco, Tunisia, and Algeria. Their history reflects a rich interaction with Iberian and North African cultures. Genetic studies reveal that Sephardic Jews have a higher proportion of ancient Israelite Semitic DNA compared to Ashkenazi Jews, reinforcing 
their direct and significant connection to the ancient Israelites. However, like the Ashkenazim, Sephardic Jews also exhibit intermingling with other populations, including Southern European and North African groups, reflecting their long-standing presence in these regions. This diversity illustrates the influence of centuries of coexistence with various populations. In terms of preserving ancient Israelite genetics, Sephardic Jews rank prominently, surpassing Ashkenazim due to the lower influence of European intermarriage and a greater retention of Semitic genetic traits. Despite regional and historical differences, Sephardic Jews represent a vital link in preserving the genetic and cultural heritage of the Jewish people. Their genetic composition not only reaffirms their connection to the ancient Israelites, but also highlights the complexity and breadth of their historical connections with different regions and cultures. While intermarriage has shaped their genetics over time, Sephardic Jews maintain a deeply rooted Jewish identity, both culturally and genetically, solidifying their role as one of the major Jewish communities in history. Mizrahi Jews, the closest genetic relatives to ancient Israelites. Mizrahi Jews, whose name derives from the Hebrew word Mizra, meaning East, include Jews who remained in the Middle East, residing in countries such as Syria, Iraq, Iran, and others. Genetic studies place Mizrahi Jews as the Jewish group with the highest proportion of ancient Israelite DNA, highlighting them as the closest genetically to the ancient Israelites. Among the Mizrahim, Iraqi Jews show a particularly high percentage of ancient Israelite ancestry, reflecting the genetic preservation that occurred in Jewish communities that remained in the Middle East, where they interacted less with external populations compared to European Jews. When comparing Mizrahim with Ashkenazim and Sephardim, it is evident that Mizrahi Jews maintain the highest proportion of ancient Israelite ancestry. This is largely due to their lower intermingling with European populations and the geographical continuity in the Middle East, which served as the historical cradle of the Jewish people. These data reinforce the role of Mizrahi Jews as guardians of a genetic heritage that is closer to the ancient Israelites. Despite small influences from other regional populations, genetically, Mizrahi Jews are the Jewish group most connected to the ancient Israelites, reflecting a history of continuity in the Middle East. The Arab identity is deeply rooted in biblical history. Some of the earliest Arab groups originated from the descendants of Lot, whose daughters, following the destruction of Sodom and Gomorrah, bore him sons through an incestuous encounter after intoxicating him. These sons became the ancestors of the Ammonites and Moabites, as recorded in Genesis 19.30-38. Another significant branch of Arab lineage descends from Abraham's second wife, Keturah. Their six sons, Zimran, Jokshan, Medan, Midian, Ishbak, and Shua, each founded tribes that spread across the region. Among them, the Midianites became especially prominent, eventually becoming a collective name for the other tribes in their genealogical line. Finally, we encounter the Edomites, who descended from Esau, the brother of Jacob and son of Isaac. Genesis 36, from verse 15 onward, lists 14 tribal chiefs including Taman, Omar, Zepho, Kenaz, Korah, Gatam, and Amal. Their lineage contributed richly to the Arab ethnic mosaic. Modern-day Jordan is situated in a region steeped in biblical history. Often identified with the ancient lands of Edom and Uz, as referenced in the Book of Job, Jordan has long been a dwelling place for various Semitic populations. The earliest settlers included the Ammonites and Moabites, descendants of Lot. Later, Edomite tribes from Esau also occupied this land. In time, the Nabataeans, a culturally sophisticated people, descended from Nebaioth, the firstborn of Ishmael, rose to prominence, best known for their rock-hewn city of Petra. Today, Jordanians carry a rich genetic inheritance from these ancient peoples, 
studies show that around 73.2% of their DNA stems from Semitic ancestors, primarily the Moabites, Ammonites, and Ishmaelites. In some individuals, this ancient Semitic component reaches as high as 63%, testifying to the deep historical roots of the Jordanian people. Saudi Arabia, a heartland of Semitic heritage. When analyzing the genetics of Saudi Arabians, the results are both fascinating and biblically aligned. According to a study titled Saudi Arabian Y Chromosome Diversity and its relationship with nearby regions, between 69% and 75% of Saudi DNA originates from Levantine Semitic groups. This aligns perfectly with the biblical account of Abraham's six sons by Keturah. Tribes like the Midianites and the descendants of Jokshan, father of Sheba and Dadan, originally settled in the region now known as Saudi Arabia. Due to Saudi Arabia's proximity to Yemen, it's also likely that descendants of Joktan, Katan, mentioned in Genesis 10, contributed to the region's genetic heritage. Together with the Ishmaelites, these tribes formed the core of what we now recognize as the Saudi Arab genetic profile. From Jordan to Palestine to Saudi Arabia, the people of the Middle East carry the living legacy of their biblical ancestors. These modern populations reflect a genetic and historical continuity with ancient Semitic tribes, Ammonites, Moabites, Ishmaelites, Edomites, and Midianites. Far beyond myths or folklore, Genetic research confirms what scripture has long preserved. The peoples of the Middle East are deeply rooted in the stories of Abraham, Lot, Ishmael, Esau, and their descendants. May this deeper understanding of our shared past inspire greater connection, respect, and curiosity. God bless you and see you in the next video.